All right, it's time for a visitor's comment. Anyone out in the audience? Okay, I will have to read this. And the Board of Education welcomes and encourages the participation of its citizens in the business school district. There are two points in the meeting where visitor statements are scheduled. Citizens are welcome to raise questions or make comments at either one. Comments will be limited to three minutes per individual and cannot be combined. Please note the Board of Education will not answer questions or engage in dialogue during visitors' comments. If a person would like additional time to address the board, <coughs> such a request should be submitted in writing 48 hours before the meeting to the superintendent. In addition, the Board of Education is interested in receiving suggestions and concerns from members of the community. Any individual may make a suggestion or express a concern at the district or the school office. All suggestions and or concerns will be referred to the appropriate level level staff member or district administrator who is most able to respond in time and matter. Each concern or suggestion shall be considered on its merit. An individual who is not satisfied after following the channels of authority may file grievance under the board policy 2 260 uniform grievance procedure. Neither this policy nor the uniform grievance procedure creates an independent right to a hearing before the board. For more details, please refer to Board Policy 2 230, Public Participation in Board Education Meetings and Petitions to the Board, and Board Policy 8 110, Public Suggestions and Concerns. All right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I took you longer to read that, though. Yes. I was going to say. First, um, Bridget Tarrant, uh, do I have to say my address? No, just, just your village. Oh, your Brookfield. First, thanks for board members for spending so much time of twice a month at least for going over all the budget and everything. It's, it's very tedious. Um, and the other thing I just wanted to say is the bond resolution that's been you guys have voted on, I know that people just want to see if they can have community input on it or just you guys decide what the money is for. So I know Ms. Towner, when you were running for board, you said you wanted community involvement. So we'd really like to see that that was something that's a priority. So you guys can have input from everybody that's paying taxes to the district. And that's all I want to say. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, discussion, informative items. Um, any member request any uh, additional discussion items? Look to my left, to my right. Next week, are you asking for next meeting? No. It's at the end. It's at, at the end. end. And, and, okay. Yep. All right, um, we put this on here again. The police department radio. No update. Uh, old business, life safety item, capital improvements. I already talked about that. We talked about that. that. We already talked about the audit. Uh, new business, Matt, um, any new business? No new business. Okay, then uh, we talk about going to uh, matters for closed session. Personnel, student discipline, individual student matters, purchase or lease of real property, profitable, intimate, or pending litigation, collective negotiation, school safety. All right, we have a second uh, opportunity for visitors to comment. Go ahead. Um, 